Because we've got it all. See, that's got it all. Before we begin today, would you agree with me that sometimes in life uh, we need to be told things that we don't want to hear? Because when we hear them, well, they make us feel a little bit uncomfortable. But even so, we need to hear them. We need to hear them because the truth is the truth is the truth. We're going to hear the truth once again today from the Word of God. It comes to us from Luke 16. I've titled this message, An Uncomfortable Truth. Please listen to what God has to share. Now there was a rich man, and he habitually dressed in purple and fine linen, joyously living in splendor every day. And a poor man named Lazarus was laid at his gate, covered with sores, and longing to be fed with the crumbs which were falling from the rich man's table. Besides, even the dogs were coming and licking his sores. Now the poor man died and was carried away by the angels to Abraham's bosom. And the rich man also died and was buried. In Hades he lifted up his eyes, being in torment, and saw Abraham far away and Lazarus in his bosom. And he cried out and said, Father Abraham, have mercy on me and send Lazarus so that he may dip the tip of his finger in water and cool off my tongue, for I am in agony in this flame. But Abraham said, Child, remember that during your life you received your good things and likewise Lazarus bad things, but now he is being comforted here and you are in agony. And besides all this, between us and you, there is a great chasm fixed, so that those who wish to come over from here to you will not be able, and that none may cross over from there to us. And he said, Then I thank you, Father, that you send him to my father's house, for I have five brothers in order that, they may, that, that he may warn them so that they will not also come to this place of torment. But Abraham said, They have Moses and the prophets. Let them hear them. But he said, No, no, Father Abraham. But if someone goes to them from the dead, they will repent. But he said to him, if they do not listen to Moses and the prophets, they will not be persuaded, even if someone rises from the dead. The word of God to the children of God, all thanks and praise be to Almighty God. 